Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be going through my inventory from the month of July. I know I'm a little bit late on this since it is almost the end of August, but we are going to just go ahead and go through my inventory numbers. So I haven't been on a low buy per se, but I kind of haven't been purchasing as much as I usually do. Um, I haven't been on a no buy or a low buy right now. Um, I've just kind of been, you know, focusing on reducing my collection. Um, but we're going to go through some numbers starting off with the makeup category. So I do keep a spreadsheet of all of my categories of products. I keep track of makeup, body care, candles, skincare, and hair care and I go through them pretty much once a month. I will link down below my spreadsheet that I use um, if you guys want to try and use that. It's actually based off of Ashley Nicole here on YouTube, my friend. Um, she keeps track of her stuff through a spreadsheet as well. Hers is a lot more organized than mine. I do not know how to work Excel. So I'll link hers as well because hers probably is a better, has all the formulas and everything. Mine is just me keeping track of things. I don't know what any of it means. I just know I'm keeping the numbers. So um, let's go ahead and start with the makeup stuff though. So um, from July to August, I actually finished up only one makeup product, but I did purchase three other makeup products. I actually kind of forgot to bring my makeup one day to sleep over at my boyfriend's house, and so I had to pick up a few items. I picked up a concealer, a mascara, and a brow product, which was a um, brow gel. And um, I did finish up an eyeliner, so my collection did increase by two for makeup, um, and I am at currently 146 makeup products, which is not too bad in my opinion. I'm steadily, you know, using things up. Um, I just wish I had used up more than I had brought in, but what can you do? Um, things happen. So currently, um, makeup collection is doing all right. For body care, um, last month I used up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight products and I brought in only two. So I actually reduced my collection by six. I currently have 84 um, body care products and last month I had 91. So pretty happy about that, reducing um, the size of my body care collection. Um, the three things that I finished up was actually three pocket backs. Um, so I did pretty good last month. I finished up pocket backs, a body wash, a body oil, a body lotion, a hand cream, and a mini shower gel. So pretty good, very happy about that. So moving on to candles. Um, last month I finished up three three wick candles and one single wick candle. So that's a total of four things that I used up. So my collection is now at 25 home fragrance items, which includes wallflowers, room sprays, and car fragrance refills. Um, and last month I was at 29. So reduced my collection by four, pretty happy about that. And for skincare, uh, let's see. Last month I used up a toner, but I also purchased a new toner, and then I used up a face mask. So that is uh, one product down for my skincare collection. I'm at 36, and last month I started out at 37. Um, for my hair care category, which is the last category, I used up a leave-in conditioner and I bought a new one. And then I also used up a hair oil, so I reduced my collection by one. I have 28 hair products, and last month I started out with 29. So not too bad. Um, actually really good this year. I think everything is decreasing besides makeup, so that's pretty good. But I do know in the month of August I have uh, purchased a lot of Bath & Body Works products. Um, I actually do plan on going in store and exchanging a few items that I have. Um, I think I'm going to exchange a body lotion and a candle, a three-wick candle. Um, so I do have those items to exchange. I actually have quite a few items um, that I want to exchange eventually. Um, I have, let me see, one single wick candle, one, two, three, four, five, six full-size, I mean, three-wick candles. And let's see how many body care items I have. I think I have a lot of body lotions. I have three body sprays 
and four body lotions and three shower gels that I can exchange. So I have a lot of stuff that I can exchange, um, which will be good because I do want to get a lot of new fall stuff. Um, of course, most of the stuff that I want is online exclusive, so I can't really exchange for those. But the stuff that isn't online exclusive, I do plan on exchanging for. Um, but I did already purchase a few things. So August is probably going to be uh, a month where I have an increase in my collection. But what can you do? Um, so far, I don't plan on going on a no buy or a low buy anytime soon. Um, maybe in September, once I've finished getting, you know, all my fall hauls done. Um, but I haven't been participating in any of the sales lately. I just kind of haven't seen the need. Um, so like my hand soap collection they just had an amazing hand soap sale i think 395 was the hand soap sale but i have 14 hand soaps and let me see how many of those are full um let's see i have a toasted vanilla chai i have a cozy vanilla cream blueberry crumble and blackberries and basil so i have four fall hand soaps i think that's gonna last me for a while i might pick up maybe a few halloween ones and be done for fall um i don't think i really need hand soaps so i didn't participate in that sale i also did not participate in the 12.95 or 12.50 three week sale because i have a lot of fall candles already um i actually have 17 three wicks um, let's see which ones of those are fall themed. So I have whipped coffee, which I'm kind of considering fall. Sweet carrot cake, which I saved for fall. Pumpkin donut shop. Um, banana walnut muffin, pumpkin vanilla cream, warm apple pie, and pumpkin donut shop again. Um, so I have a lot of fall candles already. Like I really don't need many, but I do plan on exchanging for a few. So yeah, so I'm kind of predicting that my numbers are going to stay pretty stagnant. Um, at least candle wise and makeup and skincare I'm doing pretty good on um, so I don't know I think I'm at a pretty good place right now in my collection I'm really focusing like once I focus on a product like a candle or a body care item then I can like finish it up very easily if I focus on it so I've kind of been going through that lately and being really focused on finishing certain things so it's actually been pretty good and I've been distracted a lot lately work has been super crazy life has been super crazy um, and I'm just like busy so I'm not really focused too much on like shopping a lot like I would be if I wasn't as busy if I had a lot of free time of course I'd be shopping a lot but <laughs> I don't have too much free time currently so it's actually been really helpful in um calming down my shopping addiction so that's been kind of like working out i don't know <laughs> but that's everything for today's video short and sweet kind of just um going through my inventory today but let me know down below where you guys are at with your inventory are you like going crazy for fall already i haven't gone too crazy but i have done some hauls um and i'm really excited to start using all the stuff once it's not 100 degrees outside like it was today um but let me know down below something that you picked up recently and if you're happy with where your collection is at or if you're kind of like me and still focusing on using up products but thank you guys so so much for watching this video and i will see you guys in the next one bye